There is a saying used as an expression to imply that a person has a good memory or won't forget something. An elephant never forgets. But maybe we should change it to a caterpillar never forgets or a butterfly never forgets. Anyways, there was a study done in 2008 that might suggest that moths and butterflies are able to remember their past life as a caterpillar. Caterpillars go through a process called pupation where they basically experience a complete change in morphology and lifestyle. This metamorphosis is a full rewiring of body parts including the nervous system. And within that process the caterpillar basically turns into soup and is restructured into a beautiful butterfly that not only looks very different than the caterpillar but also has a different diet, locomotion and different senses. So basically everything is pointing in the way that those two phases of life, the caterpillar phase and the butterfly phase, are two very separate things and that the butterfly makes a clean break with its caterpillar past. However, the before mentioned study on specifically the tobacco hernworm might suggest that butterflies or moths are well aware of their past self as a caterpillar after going through metamorphosis. The overall premise of the study done by Martha R. Weiss and colleagues at the Georgetown University in Washington DC was to see if it is possible to train a caterpillar to do something it could remember as an adult moth. The tobacco hernworm caterpillars are robust and bright green with white diagonal striped markings and a small protrusion or horn on the last abdominal segment. Those cute little things were exposed to the odor of the compound ethyl acetate which has a somewhat glue-like or nail polish-like scent. Shortly after they were exposed to this smell, the caterpillars would receive a mild electric shock. This procedure was repeated once an hour for 8 hours. 78% of the caterpillars that were shocked directly after exposure avoided the compound in subsequent tests while still in the larval stage. This was tested in a Y-shaped tube where the animals could choose between an area smelling like ethyl acetate or an area with normal fresh air. It has to be said though that these animals would normally show no preference between those two scents. After that, the caterpillars would live their life until they would disappear into brown, urn-shaped pupil chambers. The process of metamorphosis would start, dissolving their body and brain into a soup and within a time frame of 5 weeks reshaping it into a moth. At this point, the researchers would yet again give the now moth the choice between fresh air and air that has an ethyl acetate scent. 77% of the moth avoided the compound for up to 50 days after hatching, suggesting that the lesson learned as a caterpillar is remembered as an adult. To strengthen the case that this effect stems from enduring memories and neural structures, the experiment was repeated using younger, one-week-old larvae with less developed brains. After their metamorphosis to adult moths, they would forget the connection between shock and scent. To further eliminate effects caused by traces of leftover chemical on the caterpillar and pupil, another group of pupae was sprayed with a heavy dose of ethyl acetate. The chemical by itself had no impact on their behavior as adults. So ultimately, the findings could have implications for how neurons and synapses can reconnect after a stroke or other kind of brain damage and could therefore be also very helpful with our own brain health. The study could also explain how females know which plants to lay their eggs on since they may remember the type of plant they fed on as a caterpillar. Overall a very interesting study and definitely something to make you think about how little we actually know. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you liked it and enjoyed watching. If you did, please click on the like button. Also feel free to subscribe to the channel so you won't miss any new videos. It is free and only takes one second to do. But most importantly, take care of yourselves and have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day.